Hello everyone, Dej here back again with another video. So today we're going to take a look at mTwix. So this is an application for tweaking your uh, CPU frequencies and uh, GPU frequencies as well as the CPU and uh, GPU voltage. This is also uh, controlling uh, the LED and uh, the wake walks uh, of the phone. So uh, let's first uh, take a look at the about section of the phone. So as you can see uh, right now I'm going to show you the M2X application running on Notorious Kernel version 1.6.4 but uh, this uh, application is also supported by Moral Kernel and uh, basically uh, almost every kernel that is out there for uh, our device. So uh, to start off you will be greeted after I will leave an APK into the description to uh, download and install this application. So first of all there is an overall section which shows you uh, how much uh, the certain frequencies uh, has been used by percentage and uh, by time as well as uh, how much of a deep sleep you're getting uh, from that CPU and uh, then let's go into the inter interesting stuff so uh, the first of all you can uh, see that under the kernel section there is a CPU so after we come over here you can see that uh, I've set my CPU maximum frequency to uh, this value over here and uh, probably yours uh, will be to, uh, to 2600 so uh, basically by reducing uh, this over here you will uh, save some battery and uh, if you're not a hardcore gamer you will uh, not notice uh, any difference. So also under CPU governor this is uh, this uh, CPU governor determines uh, how the CPU behaves in response to changes in uh, wake world. So uh, mine is set to interactive which uh, I think is the default one. So uh, this one over here, these, those values are for the big uh, CPU and over here now are the little CPU. So um, mine is set to 1378 uh, over here and uh, the maximum is 1586. So as well as the minimum is uh, set to uh, 338 and as well the CPU governor is on interactive. So. Uh, over here our job is uh, done so uh, after we go to the second section under the kernel uh, menu is uh, CPU big voltage so over here uh, I have uh, global voltage so uh, click this this thing over here and uh, for the big ones set this to uh, I'm just not seeing uh, this minus button under the view viewfinder so uh, to minus uh, 62.5 for uh, the big uh, CPU and then just swipe and go to the little CPU and make it to minus uh, 56.25 so after that next thing uh, we're going to go to a uh, GPU and then uh, the GPU maximum uh, frequency is set to 600 and uh, the minimum is set to 260 and um, the next thing is uh, over here the GPU governor is uh, interactive which uh, this is something uh, you must uh, keep in mind that this is uh, for now the best one and uh, down here you can see that uh, the GPU voltage control is set to minus uh, 25 for global voltage so uh, this basically covers uh, all the frequencies that uh, are for the GPU next thing that I really like uh, over here is that you can uh, make the LEDs uh, fade so uh, I'll just click that test button and you can see how it uh, if uh, this thing focuses you can see how the LED fades out and uh, comes back so uh, this is something uh, really nice you can see over here it would be nice if I receive another message or notification but uh, never mind so uh, next uh, thing this is uh, probably one of the most important ones is uh, going to wake walk and uh, disable everything over here the, uh, you will not see any difference this is um, something uh, really nice so for example I have uh, booted uh, almost all the time, like 90% of the day because uh, my car uh, audio is on uh, Bluetooth from uh, my phone and uh, as well my uh, smartwatch is uh, almost uh, always connected to my phone. So um, for example I have disabled the Bluetooth wake walk and um, I noticed uh, no differences in uh, the Bluetooth behavior and as well as the other things that are listed over here. So. Uh, just just uh, click those uh, away and you have uh, better standby time so over here the, the, um, for example I've tried the build prop editor but uh, for me it's not working uh, probably I have done uh, something uh, which is uh, which is making it not to work but uh, you can always go to with a file manager to change uh, the build prop so this is not uh, big of a deal and uh, basically you can see everything that is uh, 
over here every everything uh, that is uh, capable of uh, being changed so um, also in settings there is a dark theme which I uh, recommend because it's uh, look nicer than the white one with uh, blue accents so um, yeah I really like uh, the dark one so uh, this uh, gives you the opportunity to uh, basically lower um, to make your battery last longer which is uh, really nice in uh, those uh, long days and of course you can apply on boot for everything uh, which is over here so for example you can see that now if I go and uh, restart my phone really fast over here you see that uh, it will not apply those things uh, right away and it will wait uh, something like 10 seconds I think you can change this value from uh, 5 seconds up to 60 and uh, during those 10 or uh, whatever seconds you can uh, always change uh, those settings or turn the application off so uh, if you mess up uh, with the settings you can uh, always revert back uh, to stock values or to change them to something that is going to work for you which is really nice uh, over here so let me just uh, type on my pin code so uh, now you're going to see from m tweaks it should pop out right now yeah, so uh, here it is. You can see that uh, it's going to apply settings in uh, just a couple of seconds over here. So you can always uh, go and cancel this thing. So you just saw that uh, applying settings is completed. So right now, all those settings uh, that I just uh, went through are uh, valid and uh, are working. So for example, right now my CPU is uh, uh, with minus 62.5 and everything is uh, working fine under those values and uh, you're going to get uh, be uh, better battery life and uh, always you can change them to your liking so uh, this is it uh, basically for this video guys uh, I hope you liked it and that I helped you in uh, improving your battery so um, be sure to click that like button if you like the video if you have any comments uh, for this device be sure to leave them down below and I will make sure that uh, I respond to them uh, if you want, you can check out my uh, other videos, there are like 50 of them already for uh, custom ROMs, uh, kernels and uh, battery saving tips and everything. Be sure to click that subscribe button for more videos that are upcoming. So thank you for watching, Dej was here with you. Peace.